We've been trying to understand the mechanisms responsible for scar tissue formation in the liver following uh, liver injury. And liver injury can take any form, uh, virus induced, alcohol induced, inherited liver diseases. And that liver disease, if it's left untreated, progresses to scarring or fibrosis, cirrhosis, uh, and liver cancer, which ultimately causes end stage liver disease. We've discovered the mechanism whereby um, the liver responds to induce inflammation. So we know that inflammation is a pivotal initial step to priming the liver to produce scar tissue. What we didn't know is that there's a particular protein in liver cells called ferritin that's released that impacts on nearby fibroblasts to induce that inflammation. So what we've discovered is that this protein ferritin interacts with a particular type of receptor on the cell surface of these fibroblasts to induce inflammation. We knew the protein existed, we know that it's released into the blood, we had no idea it actually had a deleterious effect on the liver. This is a really significant observation because for the first time we're able to identify the mechanism whereby inflammation is induced in liver disease so that we can then target that interaction between the protein, ferritin, and its receptor uh, and interfere with that interaction to stop inflammation. There are about a billion people worldwide who have some form of liver disease. That's really significant in the grand scheme of, of all chronic disorders. About two million people worldwide die of cirrhosis each year. And if left untreated, that will continue to grow. This is a significant um, milestone for the Institute. We've been working for the past 15 years, um, more so over the last five to six years to identify this mechanism. So it's been a significant period of time. Uh, we've had support from the uh, National Health and Medical Research Council in that time. What we can now do is go on to develop therapeutics, which ultimately will stop liver disease forming.